Well, as Hurricane Laura does inch closer, some Texans are already evacuating areas like Galveston. 25 News reporter Hallie Jones is live in College Station with much more. Those who will be evacuating here to Brazos County only have one option to stay at one of the 35 local hotels. As Hurricane Laura approaches landfall, Brazos County Emergency Management have been preparing for evacuees to arrive in Brazos County. Try to keep track of um, who's coming into the area um, as far as evacuees, um, working with our hotels to make sure to, to try to figure out how um, how full they're going to get or how full they are. The Hyatt Place College Station already sold out for the remainder of the week. Brazos County officials say as of Tuesday afternoon, free shelters won't be available. We don't have any shelters set up at this time and we're not planning on it, but it, this is a fluid situation, so it's, it's ever changing. Susan Wardard evacuated from Orange, Texas, right in the path of Laura and says she's expecting to find damage when she returns home. We kind of are. If it, if it goes where they say, uh, it's about a mile from my house, the river is, so, uh, and it's supposed to go up to the lake and we have a place at the lake, so we're kind of worried about three places. We have a mother's house too, so. Besides worrying about her home and property, evacuating during a pandemic is bringing a different level of stress to hurricane season. We brought stuff to clean up the room with and I just, I'm not too scared of the coronavirus anyway, it just, but I feel safe. As of now, emergency management top priority, keeping the residents safe if the county is affected by Hurricane Laura. More evacuees are expected to make their way to the Brazos Valley. Brazos County Emergency Management reminding residents to make sure they have emergency kits ready that include masks and hand sanitizers. Reporting live in College Station, Hallie Jones, 25 News.